Peer mentoring is essentially providing a student support network for the New Year 7s by sixth formers and all the students who have had the experience of CHS. The kind of the sixth form can offer advice that teachers potentially don't have mm. um, because obviously we've gone through all these different things that they might not have gone through. You just need to be able to, to be someone to listen rather than someone that's constantly giving advice or different information to them that they might not take on board as fully. There's a lot of really nice uh, talking activities and stuff that we do. It's always like a really kind of fulfilling thing where you, you've been in a role that is you know really helping people out to get to know that you're doing the right thing and that people are really appreciating what you've done for them. When I was in year seven I didn't exactly know what altruism was but I feel like when you see it, you can't be afraid of it. You've just got to throw yourself into as many activities as you can possibly get involved in. Because like, when you're in year seven and when you're like getting older, you're growing into who you want to be. And if you're going to be someone who shows like their altruism outside of school and when they're older, like that is such an amazing quality to have. We hosted an event called the Gender Agenda. We're not talking about things that directly impact ourselves, but wider society. And the things we talk about, things we do, I think will help us and other people. I'm part of the Medical Sciences Pathway at Cheadle Hume. I think it's a synergy of being able to undertake a scientific career, but similarly being able to directly apply this to working with and helping people in the community. At the end of Year 7 we did a project about plastic in the oceans, which kind of made us realise how much in danger the world is. We went on a trip to the Gambia in Africa, to um, help out with the local schools and we brought stationery over and iPads and laptops. Trying to improve their lives really. Although they had very little, they were all so happy to see us and they were all um, just so happy so it was very, it was quite emotional. We, we decided to sell like, reusable straws. People buy a lot of straws at school, we made a few sales outside of school like uh, nationally and uh, to small businesses and cafes. So yeah, it's gone really well. The paired reading scheme that we do at Hursthead is brilliant because we get to get into contact with the school so that helps our communication skills. And also we have the same group of children each week on Tuesdays and Thursdays. So they're familiar with us and we're familiar with them. So we know their weaknesses and their strengths when it comes to reading and we write comments to them and chat to them about everyday life and what's going on in their lives at home. So that gives them something to look up to as they're growing up through primary school.